you can put a thing in your mouth, why not put it in other, what's the difference? Well, I just think that just because two people are attractive doesn't mean that they're attracted to each other. I don't agree with her though, I promise. Get a good job, <laughs> don't live with your mom. I was wondering, does anal count as having sex for the first time? <laughs> yes, it does count. And God is watching. And <laughs> I knew a girl though, this is a funny story, I knew a girl in college that um, she really honestly believed that if she only had oral and anal sex that she was still a virgin. She, wow, was, uh, she was misinformed. <laughs> yes, I said. If there is a penis penetrating a bodily orifice, that is sex. So oral sex is sex? That counts I mean, as having sex for the first time? If you're 14, yes. Because all the little girls nowadays thinking if they give head that, that they're still a virgin. Yeah. I mean, uh, I don't know. That is oral movie of the week. Sex. I don't know. <laughs> so but yeah, if you're like on that, dating but. a guy though and you're not 14 and you have <laughs> oral sex, okay. does it count? Do you say you've had sex with him? I mean, I don't, I don't know. I, I you would just you say you had oral sex. Or is that if you can put a thing in your mouth, why not put it in other, what's the difference? Like, to me, I don't see the I don't get it. Like people Personally, like, I've always thought that the mouth is worse than the other no. That's not, not worse. Yes, not I'm more yes. personal. But more yes, personal. Yes, I agree. So that yes, comes I completely after agree. the other. Yes. Like, it's like or they go we, hand we in good. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like, oh, I'll go down on you, but we can't have sex. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That makes no sense. And are you going, are you, is there a condom <laughs> happening when you're going have, down on you know, him? Because oral hygiene, so they don't care. So maybe that's, <laughs> they'll just do that with anybody. So they don't keep this up, but they keep this up. I didn't say they keep that up either, but some oh. people just don't care about their mouths. <laughs> oh, and there you have it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alrighty, my question is, is it possible for an attractive man and an attractive woman to be strictly platonic friends? It's possible, but I if you're asking possible. the question in that way, you're up to something. So. Well, I just think that just because two people are attractive doesn't mean that they're attracted to each other. That's true. Because other people think that, you know, everybody else might think that the guy is cute and you might not. So, whatever. Or maybe it's something else. It might not even be about the looks, but there's certain deal breakers that people have that you make you not want to mess with that person. Most like of my guy friends will or say kids or any of those things. <laughs> you said pink bumps. Yeah, pink bumps. Pink that bump. that might. I mean, he could be attractive, but but he has pink bumps. Exactly. You know that he has pink bumps. Is, woo, that's you, a deal breaker. But that's why you already, you already crossed the line. But you can so be you friends. Can't just you can't be friends because friend? you know he has pink bumps. Oh, so you're saying after the fact? No, not even after the fact. Just well, you see pink bumps, you know. No, maybe he disclosed that to you asking advice about <laughs> <laughs> if you're yeah, friends, you should tell each other stuff. Then. <laughs> I think it boils down to if you're in a relationship and and something makes your significant other uncomfortable, that is very true. then you have to take that into consideration. However, just because you're in a relationship doesn't mean you drop the friendships that you've already had. This, yes. this is my I had a dumb you. ex. Let me just talk <laughs> on some experience real quick. You it's one know. thing if you have existing friendships. You know what I'm saying, or um, you know, people you've already had in your life. But if you're in a relationship and you're like, oh, making new friends at the club, yeah, making new different. friends at the bar, having a little sexy time text talk with your friend, no, no. And There's a very to, clear like, line between friendship and I want to hit that. Yeah, and, and you have to clear. be honest with yourself about that too. Like, don't have a boyfriend and be like, oh, you're just jealous when clearly you know that that friend has been trying to talk to you since right. you met. Exactly. So, yeah, just because you're not giving it up doesn't mean that you're just friends. Great question. Mm -hmm. All right, hey, how you doing? This question is for Rachel. What's up? Good to see you. Remember me? Remember me? Yeah. Um. I saw you in an actor's workshop a few weeks back. Hey, what's up? Yeah, I came over and I asked you politely if we could go out. And you said that you would think about it and you took my phone number. So I was just wondering, <laughs> why haven't you called me? It's been a little minute and I've been sitting by the phone waiting for you to call. You took my BBM, you took my phone number, and I know you got my Facebook. So, I was just wondering why haven't you called me yet. That's all I was wondering. Okay. Um. <laughs> you're fine, but you're crazy. <laughs> yeah. She was washing her hair that night. He's fine. I don't know why you didn't call him. I'm confused too. He's crazy. So? He's 
Nobody said you had to marry the dude. He looked like he'd be a good time. You see that shit on his neck? Girl. Um, That's some gangster for you. You need some gangster you in your life. Introduce him to Jesse. Yes! This no. is my friend Jesse. No, I've um, been there done that. That's, that's um, so 08 for me. But you, on the other I hand. I will definitely send her your Facebook information and. Um, I'm going to send you her address. The, the woo. <laughs> Got you. <laughs> you can tell. You can tell by. Did you see the size of his head, girl? That dude packing. What? You can tell. Of his head. Yes. But wait, I want to know more about the size of the head and how that is. Oh, He's not stopping you. Just he just want to know why you haven't called him. just want to know why you haven't called him. Yeah. You have the power. Why are you being such you a tease, have the Rachel? And the Facebook and the I didn't realize it was a big tease. I'm sorry. I don't. I don't remember. That's bad, isn't that? Mm -hmm. Don't say that. Okay.